Hi, gay. It's gay month. Do you want gay, gay stuff? stuff? You gay person. Aren't you serving, you, you waitress? <laughs> Work! Slay! <laughs> and I am now in the closet again. Hi friends, my name's Frederick, and it's gay month, and we're still going on with this series. Why am I doing this still? Either way, that's gay. You see that? <laughs> yes, it's a kombucha bottle, okay? Don't judge me. GTS, if you're ever watching, uh, sponsor me. Before we do the video, I do want to announce that I am also a victim of rainbow capitalism. We got rainbow earrings, y'all. Yeah. Oh, shit, that's my phone. Yeah, get into, mm. They're limited edition for now until the end of June. It's on our merch site. You know what it is. Go check it out. For all we know, I might keep it around because I don't know how many people are gonna buy it so it's a limited supply if a lot of people want it we might keep it around so go get it while you can and you'll be supporting a gay <laughs> this is sterling silver and it's gold plated and just mm. now let's talk about logos as a graphic design major <laughs> how many times have i said that three this month Probably more. As a graphic design major in his senior year, I believe I am the pinnacle of knowledge in terms of what is a good logo and what isn't. Why? Because I took one design class. <laughs> but on a serious note, there is a lot of stuff that goes into a logo. Like, what does it do for your brand? Does it stand out on its own? Is it unique? And as we all know, there is a trend with um, companies where they suddenly change their logo just for June. Only June, maybe even Black History Month. I honestly don't know, but they love to change the logo when it's convenient for them. Not AAPI Month, God forbid. God forbid they do a yellow logo. <laughs> but I think every queer person recognizes it as, uh, you're sucking up to us. You just want to suck dick for one month and then leave again and go back to your, you know, vaginas. Well because it's always a straight man who thinks of this, right? It, I don't know if it's even cute. Like, it's it. what does that do for the community? I'll say this again. It's like if you post a yellow square for AAPI month, and that's all you do. Maybe feature LGBT creators on your platform instead of banning them. <laughs> Donate to organizations or raise money. It's just simple as that. Have LGBT people in your campaigns. Have the actual community be a part of it instead of slapping a rainbow on your logo. But because I love tacky, I want to rate all of them. And I will give some critiques on how to redesign them. So I tweeted out, I think a few weeks ago, like, let me know what companies have done this. I wanna see it. All right, first up, ASDA. I don't know what this company is. Also, we're not even gonna talk about like what they do for the community. I just wanna look at the logo, so I, I, that's too much research. This is a bad design. First of all, yeah, oh. <laughs> okay, I really, really hate it. This is gonna be a trend too when companies put the, the just the flag as the background. Like they take a flag and they put a clipping mask over it, over their logo, and that's what they do. I'm gonna try to explain it better. It's when you take a design and that design is overlaid over another thing. I really don't like this because you can barely see purple and pink. Like your flag is somehow stretched out and you just couldn't crop it in. So first critique is crop that. This A, that's homophobic right there because you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like, I think all the colors within this one letter. Do you see that tiny piece of green right there? We don't need that. No, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. Just make the A the trans flag. Make the S brown and black. Make the D and A freaking rainbow, man. Or just crop it out of here. Oh, and we all know they're gonna change this like July, July 1st, bye. June 30th, 1159 PM, goodbye. Tesco, I think this is gonna be a running trend of I don't know these companies, but this is actually nice. I don't mind it. I don't know what the regular logo is, but I'm assuming that the bottom is just like red or something. This is not offensive to me. It's like slightly Okay, I'll give it a three out of five of gay. Yeah, this is nice. I have no critiques, honestly. I really like that. Good, good for you. Whoever did that, good for you. Are you gay? <laughs> did you do that? Did you give that to the intern who's gay? Morrison's ugly. This is disgusting. Okay, I see what you're doing with like the muted colors. You know, you want to be different, but why don't you just make that little thing in the center like your acne mark plant thingy, the rainbow color. Look, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, pink, light blue, brown, black. That all fits there perfectly. Two out of five. 
next. Oh, and the regular banner is still the normal one. <laughs> mm, half acid, why don't you? Vodacom, no. I don't like that because these are too bright. <laughs> this yellow is disgusting. <laughs> This purple is disgusting. It's like neon, like it's it's straining my eye. That's why, if you ever wonder like why people don't like the rainbow flag on fashion, if it's neon, it's like really hard to look at and not be, it physically strains your eye. So tone that down a little bit, make the yellow a little more golden yellow, make the purple more purple and violet, make the green less that. Please no puke green ever. I don't wanna see anyone wearing puke green ever again. I will say, I do like the fact that they are including the progress flag, but why not just make it so like your teardrop thing is the flag? Like what if you blend it? Oh, oh, what if you like made it so it's all liquefied and like this? I feel like that's better. Tumblr. You know what? This can stay. Wait, no, maybe it can't stay. What is happening here? Hold on, my brain is confused. So I see the Instagram logos right here. I really like the gradient, but something is confusing about the fact that this shadow and that shadow is not, like, it, it doesn't have a color in there. Like half of it is colored, half of it isn't. Like I can't tell if it would be better if it was all colored. Maybe you don't need these two. Maybe just make the whole tee dark blue instead. I think that's enough. Other than that though, pretty cute. It's not bad. We all know Tumblr got every gay on there at some point, so. Skittles. Fuck off. <laughs> okay, I forgot to talk about Skittles. I actually don't mind their way of marketing their stuff right now. Cause if you don't know, they're like, we're taking away the rainbow because there's only one that matters right now. Or maybe it was one that matters more. Honestly, it's a good idea, but it's just like, I actually can't eat your things now because I like eating it from one color to the next. So this is very hard for me to buy it without being confused. I don't want Airheads mystery. I want to know what I'm eating, but it's a good marketing campaign, I will say. Hold on, what is this bio? The official US tweeter of awesomeness, follow the rainbow, taste the rainbow, Skittles is pog. Only one rainbow matters is pride yours. If you wanna say only one rainbow matters is pride, get rid of pog, please. Poggies. Disney, so they have a Disney banner. See what I mean? These colors are much better. I like this. Uh, I have no gripes about it because Disney has always been prideful, except when it comes to their movies and shows. They have successfully made every merch gay, but never a show or a movie. Fix that and stop being racist. <laughs> Twitch, see, this is what I mean. Like Tumblr could just could have done this with their logo. I don't like the rainbow as much as the Tumblr one. I don't mind the fact that purple's first. I just mind the fact that, I feel like you could have done a better rainbow. Tumblr did a better one. However, this banner stays. You know why? Because the cancer sign is right there. Because I know they're thinking about me. And I'm pretty sure, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. I'm pretty sure they do feature LGBT creators a lot, but they should feature me more. Facebook, this is your logo. That's not your logo now. Is that your logo? What happened to the logo I grew up with? Why is it not this? Is this your new logo? It can't be. I like how Facebook has 13 million followers, but their pride tweet got 170 likes. Yeah, um, trash this. That's boring. Your original Facebook logo is fine and just do this to it. Zoom, zoom. <laughs> This is giving me the Target shirt that I reviewed. The dark blue background. I mean, I don't mind it. What could you do to fix that? I mean, your logo is kind of, it's just your name. So like, what, what is there to do besides put a rainbow on it? But do you see what I mean? Like all of them put a gradient or just the flag color and call it the day. I feel like we need to be a little more creative in our way of, like, look at this. At least Pinterest is doing something right, but also something very wrong because these colors just don't work <laughs> at all. <laughs> No, no, Pinterest, that P has to stay completely white in order for me to understand that it's Pinterest. This is very confusing. Um, I like the fact that maybe like the paintbrushes, ooh, you know, quirky. How are you gonna do the first part of the progress flag and then just fuck up everything else? Like, I get it, you hate green, me too, we, we stand, but... No, fix it, do this. Credit Karma, is this not Calvin Klein? <laughs> Is that not Calvin Klein except like lowercase? Why is everyone changing where the flag goes? Like why sometimes trans first and then brown and black? Like choose one. This is like the bare minimum someone could have done. Also shout out to Lego for like 
doing this. You did something with this. Good for you. Now sponsor me. Okay. No, that's... Okay. Really? <laughs> like... Oh, I don't know what Soompi is, but it's a no. Paramount Plus, which is going to be featuring All-Star 6, by the way, so you know they support us. <laughs> Hello? What is this? Um, no. Once again, I no. You actually kept your original color and still slapped another rainbow on it. Do you know how many colors are in this right now? If someone is colorblind, this must be hell. I know people who will get a headache just from looking at this. First off, why is your logo not centered? Do you see what I'm seeing? This part is thinner than the width of this part with the blue. No, never. Why would you ever do that? Second of all, you have stars. Do you know what you can put in stars? Especially when you got multiple of them? Color. <laughs> so why not just do color and make it a little less gay? <laughs> you have literally, okay. Or just put it in the mountain and not, okay, bye. That's gross. I'm not even gonna rate them anymore because they don't deserve my rating. You know, I actually use this app when I don't wanna give my real phone number out to people. This, is one of the best ones somehow. <laughs> I think the first reason is the logo itself, it's a chat bubble and a call button. Apple, you missed out. They got you there. And I just like the wave and the colors. Okay, now I wanna go into Pride campaigns. Not collections, but like the promotion for them. So, American Eagle. I already know you got a Pride collection waiting for me. All right, American Eagle, you can have the Be True campaign where you can wear the rainbow on your pee pee. Oh. Oh. Oh? They really said I'm doing one post and that's it, damn. Oh no, there's another one. Oh cute, I got another one. Oh, are we about to do this? No, no, no. I'm never gonna get a sponsor from them after this. Show your pride with our new collection and join us in supporting at It Gets Better. Wait, It Gets Better, great organization, by donating at checkout in stores or online. American Eagle and Airy are proud to donate $50,000 to It Gets Better to support their mission. It's cool that they donated that, but it's actually not a lot of money compared to like what they actually make. But also, I looked at this post and it says, this weekend, American Eagle and Airy will donate $1 per real rewards transaction to It Gets Better. That means you have to be a member you have to sign up for that at checkout and you have to go that weekend and it caps at $50,000. Go to hell. You know, what does Hollerstadt to say? Oh, at least they have a rainbow logo, wow. I don't remember if like they're technically part of the same branch, I'll fact check, but I think Abercrombie owns all of them. So somehow Hollister is more prideful than American Eagle. <laughs> they have a pride giveaway. Oh, it's available to everyone, not just gays. That's a choice. <laughs> See, one of these requirements should have been, you must be gay. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Wait, why is something, why is it sideways? Why would you write that? So I don't see. I gotta go. This is so, Mm, heck, this could be a part two. But back to the logo. Uh, why is it so much red? Hollister. Why is like 30% of it red? You have like no blue in there. There is like a smidge of blue. And also, I can't see your logo even with the drop shadow because you angled it down. And the white is like right next to yellow, so it basically just blends in. Either make the bird gay or just make the drop shadow more shadowy. You did not just change. No! <laughs> they really shape their clothing to be a heart. Why couldn't this have just been your campaign? They act like we need the big ass rainbow. Like we don't have that already. <laughs> Can we get some variety here? What are some other notoriously, let's look up Warby Parker, what do y'all want? And I have high expectations because these are their glasses, so y'all better come through with something. We have any pride campaign, any pride campaign, May 15th, any pride campaign, anything, June 5th, June 1st, June 2nd, oh. Oh, they really said, I don't see gays. <laughs> this is now the opposite of rainbow capitalism. It is the lack of anything prideful during the Pride Month. I mean, 
go off. Honestly, I'm not mad at that because they might just be like, we know it's tacky. If we make any of our glasses rainbow, it's going to look bad. So we're not even going to try. I applaud you for that. <laughs> at least they own up to it. Seriously though, they have nothing? You didn't want to capitalize off of me? Maybe they're doing us a favor by not wanting to capitalize. Thanks, Warby. Did Glossier do anything? Nope. No. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, I have yet to see like any masculine or male figures on your feed. But that's another discussion. Colourpop, you have to do something, right? They have to have something, right? May 28th, May 30th, May 30th, May 30th. How much do you post in a day? Colourpop either. Really? I would have thought more, honestly. Listen, I know everything they do is rainbow, but I still would have expected like a post. What about Apple? Are y'all willing to do anything? You know what? This is honestly all they're gonna do. That is, that is the span of what they're gonna do. <laughs> and by making iMacs that are rainbow somehow. So I guess not every company's into this, but do we want all of them to? No. And this is not me saying I want them to post, God forbid someone be performative, but I just, I was curious, like, would they have that? Cause I don't keep up with them. It was just a nice thing to look at. Cause I will cringe either way, when they post and when they don't post. What if I just look up Pride logo on Twitter? BMW, BMW, ah, 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 ah. <gasps> no. Who let this go by? There's no purple. Um, first thing, no purple. Second thing, your logo is touching the blue. So there goes that, like I can't see it anymore. What if you just did this instead? Right? Why do I bother? Maybe you need a rebrand. No, why am I even bothering with cars? Who cares about cars? Sorry, Hot Wheels? Oh. I guess I was wrong. There is a car company for us. This year, we're proud to share that Mattel is sponsoring APLA Health. And so, so what does that have to do with you? Let's look at the actual logo. Uh-huh, mm-hmm. Wow, yeah, I hate it. Uh, so, yeah, the first thing, none of these stripes are symmetrical. <laughs> the blue outlining, brown and black, I'm sorry, but those colors don't belong next to each other. Could you have just made Hot Wheels rainbow? Or like, I would have honestly taken the flame to be a rainbow one. Something is wrong here though. Why is it, why is it blue? Why do, why does every pride company make things and then put a blue background as the thing? Like just, you know blue's in the rainbow, right? Just do black. Verizon? Oh, not bad. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Is that the regular logo? I feel like it's not always like that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, good job. So by the way, if you're homophobic and you have Verizon, just know that you're supporting gays. So you might as well go to like AT&T or something. Wait, speaking of AT&T, I want to see what they're doing. Oh, once. Mm. <laughs> no! We're still doing it. We are doing the blue as the background and the base color. Why don't you just make your freaking globe thing rainbow? Just do it. I don't need to see three different shades of blue on here. Do you realize that there is your dark blue as your logo? Then you have the rainbow blue, which is not, that's like a cyan. Then you got the trans flag blue. So that's three different shades. I don't even see red anymore. Like where was red? It's gone. Oh, you know what? I think Entertainment Weekly, which is like online news stuff. I think they have one. I saw a meme of it. <laughs> this is what I saw. Good job. I mean, that's all I can say. Good job. You managed to make a Pride logo against Pride. And for that, I applaud you because that takes talent. Like I already see it now. Every homophobic person is just going to be like, Pride? Ew. Zillow. Meh, meh. You didn't have any good apartments for me to see in New York City, so I don't care. I don't think about you. But also, like, wouldn't it be nice for them to actually change the logo on your app store instead of just, like, on Twitter or Instagram? That'd be nice. Will we ever see something good? Or is this just it? Has it really just come down to the rainbow? You know what? I think this is it. And uh, in conclusion, stop. Just stop. <laughs> we don't need any of that. Not necessary. We all know you do it for one month and you leave us by July 1st. It's 
rarely about the community and I think for the majority of people it makes it seem like Pride Month is a joke to them <laughs> or just a holiday at this point. I don't know. But that's all I have though. Once again, if you want to get these limited edition earrings, go check out our site because they are cute and this is the only rainbow I will wear on my body. If you enjoyed, give this video a like, leave a comment down below and subscribe for more videos every time I have time to post because I am a student and I'm moving soon. So Prepare for the moving vlogs. Social medias are all right here. No, I do not have a pride logo, so you don't have to worry about that. And as always, I love you all and everything is less than three. Now, just like every other company, I'm going to take off my rainbow, Marie Kondo it out of sight and get my money. <laughs>